Hey, I'm just Vosco and we're back in Transport Fever 2 and we're actually making money, which which is nice. That's always good when you're trying to run a business. Let's have a look at our lines. Let's see what's making money, what's not. Hub food is not making money. There is food here. What are you? You're picking up food. You're, you've picked up eight food. Wow. Okay, so hub food is bringing food down from... The far, well, the, the, the fa food factory, which is up here, right? Yes. And there's plenty sat there. 108. Okay. Let's have a look at this then. Let's see. You've got 104 on you. Why are you not full? There's plenty here. You've got a long way to go, though, haven't you? That's the issue. Hmm. I don't think it warrants more than one train at the moment look how far this thing's going this is ridiculous <laughs> oh it's got so it can take a hundred and what 104 hundred and 110 right there's 112 sat there by the time it gets back there'll be a little bit more but probably not enough for two trains so we could look it up in that we could look it up in the food source so at the minute, we got this farm here. Voss on Y farm is supplying it, and that's it. Could we get some more farms in? There's two over there. And there's one straight down. One straight down. Ooh, we've got a gap there. Could we go up and over the hill? If I put a train track in there, right, what would it do? Oh. Oh. Oh, wait, if I did it in tiny little bits. Oh, and now you're going to do that, aren't you? Urgh. And that's ugly. No, I don't like it. Hmm. What if I just came off of you? Would you go under or over? You'd go... <laughs> that's really annoying. And if I went there, you're going to put a hideous bridge in again, aren't you? Oh, that's a little frustrating. Wait, what if I went... Down? If I went down there... Would it then tunnel under? Yes. Yes, it would. And it would come out that side. Ooh, that's an interesting route. That's going to cost us 4 million just for the tunnel. But do you know what? I, I quite like that going under there. I think we should do it. Let's do it. There we go. Lovely. And we're going to continue this one through as well. So that'll be another couple of million. I'd imagine not four. Yeah, half the price. Two million to extend that tunnel. Okay, so we're through. Then we need to head over this way. So I'm presuming we're going to put another tunnel in. Which we are. We're going to put a cheeky little tunnel in here. Oh, literally, you're out in the daylight for a very, very short period. Ooh, okay. So let's just bring you back here a second. And we'll decide where our station's going to go. Because it's not looking like we've got the greatest amount of space. We, we may need to get rid of that field. Which is a little bit of a shame, really. Wait, where was that field? Oh yeah, right across. We can't we cannot avoid that field, sadly. So if I go. Hmm. Should we line this up with the fields? I feel like that would be the best option. Do I want I want one platform? Do I want it longer? Longer can't hurt, right? He says. Let's go longer. It's better to have too much then not enough. Then we're going to take this track and we're going to join it on to here. In a, oh, we've got another tunnel. Wow, this is a route of tunnels. You're going to come out there just to go across the road. Urgh, and that road's hideous now. Okay, we're going to put that in. We're going to put it in. Where's my little tick box there? We're going to delete the road and redo that because that looks horrendous. Push you back, push you back. 
like so. And then if we grab Country Road, will you bridge across automatically? No. Okay, that's fine. So if I go up, up, are you going to go up for me? Up again? And we might have to push it back a little bit more. Why do that? And then go up. Like so. And then what would you, would you bridge then? You would bridge. It's quite an ugly bridge. I'm not going to lie. Uh, wait, 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 wait. We just did that. Try and make it a little bit even on each side. Then we can push this road right back there. And that pretty much... Oh, we got another line to come through yet, haven't we? Uh-huh. Okay, that might mess it all up. Yeah, I should have put the other line in first. Let's find out what's going to happen there. Which side is it coming in? This side. Okay, so it was lucky I didn't put that in. So if we bring this all the way up here, does it ruin it? Yes. Yes, it does. Ah, <laughs> oh, what? That's my... There you go. Learn to lesson. Put the line in before you do anything else. There we go. Now we'll put the road back in. And hopefully it will go across. Oh, it actually looks nice. And Oh, no, it doesn't. Urgh. Okay, okay, okay. Push you back again. Right back. There we go. And then we're going to come off of here. And you'll go there? Oh, actually, that's not bad. I definitely hate that. There we go. Lovely. And then this line here can come through. And just uh, slip onto here. Like so. That's fairly straightforward. We're going to go one-way tracks. Yes. Uh, auto signal. Yes. You're going to be coming up this way. So you can stop there. And then going back that way, you can do that. And that should have auto signaled all the way along. All the way to there. Okay, that's good. And then if I do that on the way back, it'll match up. Lovely. And then at this point, that should be fine, I think. I think. Yeah, you're going that way. You're going that way. That's a long way between signals there. Hmm. Wait, if I put one there, that's a signal there. Uh, yeah, that should be fine. That should work absolutely beautifully. There is a lot, a lot, 542. Wow. Okay, so we need, we definitely need more vehicles on here. Let's have a look what they look like at the minute. And we're going to follow you. Are you a little train? Is that the thing? Uh, let's speed you up so you come out of the tunnel a bit quicker. Uh, you're not that small. Can we make you bigger? We can make you a lot bigger. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Manage vehicles. Replace. And we're currently using that train from the looks of it, which I don't think is a bad option. It's cheap enough. Um, yeah, I think we're going to stick with that train. We're going to stick with that train. We're going to give it a nice green color. Like so. We're going to go cargo. And you're using the gondolas, right? Which are those. One, two. Let's try and mix the colors up a little bit at least. Um, wait. A nice rusty couple. And then dark red down there. And then... So what, what have they got before? 14. So we've got two, four, six, eight. Eight so far. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten. Eleven. 12 13 14 now they, that's only mediocre but that, they are they are on quite a flat I reckon I reckon that should be okay I'm going to replace them there we go let's see how they do now so they've gone from holding quite a lot to holding tons of it so that should definitely help that how much demand do you have, sir? Customers. Only Whitney. Why have we only got Whitney as a customer? They can't be the only one who needs food. Oh, maybe they are. Stroud needs food, but we haven't connected Stroud. Stroud's the closest to all of our lines, yet not connected. 
Whitney food. So yeah, Whitney's the only place that needs... What? <laughs> what? Why? We got Malvern through there. Then where can we go from Malvern? We can go to... Uh... Liber... Le Lebury? Le I don't know how to say that one. And then down to... And then... Oh, you need food. Huh. Is there a better route? Worcester needs food. So we could go from Whitney to Oxford to Worcester. That's another possible line. Any towns up this way. Bristol needs food. Cam and Dursley needs food. Gloucester doesn't. Yeah, not many places need food at the moment. Oh, Stonehouse needs food as well. Are you actually getting food? You should definitely be getting food, right? Uh, let me click on there. No. Why? <laughs> Why are you not getting food? Wait, 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 wait. Um, food Hub T1. You're coming through here. Are you stopping in Stonehouse? Lower Stonehouse, you are. So I don't understand why you're not getting food. Wait, wait, wait. And that's saying you don't have any customers. Customers... Stonehouse 8. There we go. Oh, it is doing it. Okay. Huh. Got 42 food sat there. How many have you got? This, this, there's literally food on the platform. Why are you not moving? I'm confused. What is this train doing? Wait, speed it up. Turn it round. I don't know why he's just sat there. Get that food moving, people. You're bringing more wheat. Oh, look, there's loads of wheat. Oh, no, there's not. There's not a lot of wheat. But you should definitely have made money then, right? Oh, yeah, tons of money. Then you're going to go on your way. Huh. So hopefully these bigger new trains, because what are they carrying? 112. Already they've dented it. Already. So we probably don't need this other farm, but I'm going to put it in ready for when we do. So if I go for a new line from there, then it's going to come down to here. Yes. And we're going to call this Leo Minster. Um, so if I just call it Leo Food T1. There we go. Leo Food T1. Already set up. So that's ready to go. Until this starts running out of food, I'm probably not going to set that line up. But it's an option. We were looking at this, right? Marble. Now, Marble's got an extremely long way to go, haven't they? They're coming from past the hub all the way down here. Is there a lot of marble sat there? Oh, there's absolutely tons. And we've got big trains on there as it is, right? 128. <sighs> You're just sat there. So are you stuck waiting to get through the hub? I'm not entirely sure why you're sat there. Are you just waiting for this train to go along? Uh, maybe we need another signal. Wait, let's turn that off. And we'll put another signal going that way. Which means you should start moving. Which you are. Okay. There you are. Where are you going now? You're going to cut across here, are you? Yes, very much so. Hmm. Okay, we'll keep an eye on that. I am tempted to put another train on there. Just because there's so much there. So let's put another train on there. Yes, it's not making money. But ultimately, the bricks are the other end. What's our next least profitable? Fuel. Why is fuel not making money? I'm sure that should be perfectly fine. You're coming in with... Okay. You're both fully loaded. You're unloading there, which you've just done. Lovely. And you've picked up processed fuel and you're going to take that back with you. Mm-hmm. So you're making tons of money. You're making no money. Is that... You should make tons of money now, right? I think this is just one of those lines that's going to lose money every now and again. Let's see. How much money are you going to make dropping that off? You've dropped that off. You've made... Four, yes, and they've both loads of money, and then that's gone over there to be picked up. 
How much is sat there? 288. I don't think that should be too much of a problem. I'm tempted to put a little... Oh, tempted to put a little line in going to stride with food. But it seems such a pointless line. And I did say I was going to avoid trucks in this playthrough. And that's just a truck line though, isn't it? Let's be fair. <laughs> You wouldn't run a train in there, right? Would you? Would you? Would I? <laughs> I am tempted. Oh, it's just going to be so, so pointless. Wait, make it smaller. It definitely doesn't need to be giant. I just feel sorry for Stroud. It seems to be so close to our infrastructure, yet getting nowhere. Like, wait, wait, wait. That covers most of the town, right? It does cover all of the town. Rawr. And we only lose one building. Oh, tempting. Tempting. How would I tie it in with passengers? Probably not at the moment. Let's just put this line in for now. Then we can start sending food there. I feel like that would help our food line. And then you're going to come. <laughs> this is so pointless. Wait, 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 wait. We could bring you off of here like so 60 we're going to put such a small train on here like a tiny train let's go new line uh, from here to Stroud um, I'm going to call it Stroud Stroud in T1 so Stroud Industries oh no what have I done We've done something. Let's try that again. In T1. There we go. Industries. So anything that needs shipping here will be down to that. So let's go and buy a train. We want that very outside one. We're going to go buy vehicle. Steam. L literally, I just wanted a tiny little steam train. What? Maybe not that small. 25. 25 would work. I don't want it holding everything else up though. That's got a lot more power. Let's go with that one. We're going to buy that. We're going to go cargo. And it wants food and goods, right? So if I just put one, two, three, four of those on. What do they hold? Eight each. Five, six. We want it to be, we don't want it to be slow in and out. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with that. I think we'll test this out. It may be a really, really pointless line with the amount of food they're going to need at the moment. And if so, we can we can stop it. But I would like to have it just running backwards and forwards just to try and give our food line a boost. That's another train coming out the hub, though. The hub is, is a busy old place, but not being funny, it is flowing in and out. You're not flowing. Are you just... Waiting for that train to pass. Okay. So this is quite a busy line. Right. Back to here. So I'm expecting to see Stroud T1 very much at the top now. Marble's still losing money. You are all fully loaded though, right? Yeah, all of them. All of them are fully loaded. Uh, Swindon Steel. Why are you losing money? You're fully loaded. You're on your way. Oh, you're coming back with tools. Yeah, I think that's another one that's just sort of having a blip at the moment. Industry T1. Again, very much the same thing. I'm not... Actually, most of our lines are very profitable. I feel like a lot of those negative ones are just blips. So we can look at pushing forward. Let's have a look. So you're already down here. You haven't bought anything with you. 48 it can carry it. Oh, let's go up to our food source. Let's have a look. Customers. Stroud 26 food. Okay, that's better than I was expecting it to be. How are you doing down here? 200 in. Okay. So all of your stock is going to here. But is that enough? It's only got 316 in there. I reckon we could set up that other line. So let's do it. Let's go. Oh, I could just duplicate a vehicle. I feel like that would be the easier option. If I grab you. Wait. 
and then we go manage vehicles and we duplicate which that's our new one right you're in the depot then we're gonna go go to depot haha <laughs> that was so much easier oh why haven't i why have i not done that before now you should be in the depot right no you're coming out you don't have a line there we go now you're in the depot so we're going to take you we're going to put you on leo food t1 and you're going to get underway I do want to just slightly alter, alter that route though. In Leominster, I want you to be fully loaded before you leave. And hopefully, it'll start producing some food for us now. Yeah, there we go. Lovely, so that's going to help as well. So I reckon food's good. What are you? You're stone. Okay, so how's stone doing? Is there a lot of stone? Not really. Not really. I think that's probably the right amount of of trains on there. I'm going to go up to here to the brickworks. There is so much coal sat here. 474. Bricks are coming in and out, which is lovely. That's marble. Look, 5 million. But it loses it all on the way back. That's the issue. You're picking up bricks. Are you actually making money? A little bit. Little bit of money. Are you just struggling for resources? Customers? Stonehouse is the only people you're supplying. Why is that then? Are they the only... Stonehouse needs bricks? Who else needs bricks? Someone must. Simon Sester does. Swindon does. And... Oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Huh... How am I going to tie Sirencester in? And it needs food as well. We could come off here. But then we're going to have to cross through all of this. If I come into there and then out, we could do a triangle. That's not a bad idea. Not a bad idea at all. So what's going on here? We've got passengers that side industry that side okay 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 let's go buildings let's grab one of those we're gonna make it longer and we're gonna put probably one platform i feel is enough and we want you smack bang in the middle of the tank right yes yes we do we want you to destroy everything there okay i'm gonna pause it just because i don't want them building up as i'm as i'm playing around so I reckon one industry line there will be plenty. It doesn't need a through line. So if I do that, which will make people very, very not happy, we're going to get rid of you and you and you and you. And yes, I know you're not happy because I deleted the road, but that's very easy to fix. There we go. Fixed. Done. Then here we're going to go terminals. No, we're going to go configure. We're going to add standard track. Huh. If I leave a gap, then we put a passenger platform. Oh, actually, I don't need to leave a gap. Because we only need one passenger platform because it's going to be coming in and out the same direction. <gasps> oh, that's nice. Yes. That makes my life a little easier, if I'm honest. So we can do that and then we can go passenger building. I'm guessing I can't put you that side because that would be far too easy, right? It would go on the end though. I feel like that's a bit cheating. So if I did that and then we come out of that and have a look, that still picks up pretty much everything. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. So then you're going to be coming round. Oh, is that a bridge there? It is. Hmm. Okay, let's think about this. We'll come back to you in a minute. We want all of these lines to come off here. Which could be a bit of a pain. 
at a good speed as well would be good. That that's not bad. I'll take that. We'll take that. They're both be coming out of here that way. So this only needs to be a one direction, right? And then if I just put split switches, this might be easier than I was expecting. If I do that, go in that direction. And then where does that bridge? Aha, from here. If we go that direction, can I get a better? Yeah, 75. I'll take that as well. And then we go there. Perfect. We're sort of linking in the times we've missed in the area, which is actually quite nice. Then you can come across this way. You can very much come up here, we're going to say. Let's see. Oh, no, that might. Mm. Oh, that's a bit tight. Ultimately, I could do with this gone. Let's get rid of that. It's not being used anyway. Goodbye industry. That probably cost me a fortune. So if I do that. And link you in. Like so. And then we'll bring you out as well. Because we want passenger. We do want it. Oh, we want a separate line for passengers, right? But I feel like. There won't be too much industry coming through here. So what if we go from. Oh, where, where, wait, 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 wait. Passenger service is. Red. So you'll be able to just slide up there. Industry could also slide up there. I'm thinking. Could we take this off? Wait, where's that join? The join's there. So if I come across here. No, that's not going to work. That's far too close. I just want to get industry on its own separate track would be nice. Yes, that would work. Industry is going to be a bit slower anyway, in all fairness. So if I do that, then we want to go split switch there. We don't need them there, right? No, we don't. So that'll be industry and passenger coming in. And then we want to come out of there. So if we do... Oh, I don't know. I want, I want, I want a fairly nice speed. It is coming out of the station anyway. So the speed's going to be low because it's only just starting out. But if we do that, I feel like that would work to there so you've got coming in coming out and then this can just join on to there that road's in my way isn't it excuse me mr road yeah you're in my way i know you're not happy just bear with me one second you're going to come through here like so you're going to come down here oh oh we've got a bridge Oh, that was... I wasn't expecting a bridge there. Wait, 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 wait. Are you going to put that bridge back in now? So if I go from here to there, then we can change that bridge so it's a better speed. I like the look, the look of the old bridges, but the speed is terrible on them. Yeah, we'll go with that one. That works fine for me. Perfect. Then you, sir, can come down here. And again, we got some really nice speed coming across this bit. And ultimately, we want... Huh. I suppose... Mm. Wait, 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 wait. Let's consider this. Uh, you're going to come into there. You're going to go across this line here, which... Disappears. So I'm not entirely sure if there's a line there or not. Oh, it's because it's raising up at that point. Oh, that's that's an issue. Wait, 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 wait. We can we can fix that because that looks really, really ugly. Really ugly. Let's start this again. This end. We're gonna get rid of all of this. Do you know what? We'll get rid of. Wait, if I hold shift, right? Yeah, there we go. Put all that out. 
Then we're going to go to terrain. We are going to smooth the terrain out. I want the biggest brush size, best strength. Let's do it. Let's smooth all this out. That might help a little bit. I'm tempted to flatten it. Um, flatten terrain. Yeah, if we push you back, we may not even need a bridge there. Then we'll smooth it out. Like so. Which I'm okay with. And then from this point, wasn't it? We were coming off here. At a fairly reasonable pace. Like so. You're going to come from there. And you're going to join on to here. Lovely. And I don't think we're going to need a bridge. Yeah, I think we can get rid of all that bridge. Uh, shift. People still hate me because I deleted that road. But I can live with that. Let's just push you all the way out here. Perfect. Happy. Good. Grab you. Connect you onto that line. Bring you down onto there. We get rid of the bridge that we just paid for. <laughs> and that works okay. And that looks a lot better there. A lot better. Yes. And then it's this end we were trying to figure out, wasn't it? So I think the outside is going to be industry, which needs to be on the outside. Okay. So then the passenger service only needs to go from... Wait, if I take it from the same spot... Can you do that? Because the passenger service only needs to do there. I'm going to make that a slip switch. I don't know if I need to. But yeah, we'll do that. Then we can grab a bit of road and fix this before they start having a, a moan. Is that too high? I don't know. One, two, three, four. Four? Will four go across there? Yes, it will. Perfect. Then you, sir, onto there. You, sir, onto there. And that makes them happy. Makes me happy. Let's have a look at our passenger service. It's coming through here. So that's red. Okay, so from Mulva, we're going to add a new station. And we're going to go to here. And it's going to come back down that way. Yes, perfect. Okay, so that, that doesn't cost us anything train-wise. That just adds in a new drop-off. Industry T1. Do I want you to? Maybe. Maybe. If we go after Marlborough, we'll add a station in. That's going to go up there as well. And they're not going to get in each other's way. That's lovely. Now we just need to signal it up. So these are both one way. Auto signal, yes. And then you're going to come there and there. And that should signal all the way down here. Which it has. Perfect. And then this way, we're going to put a signal there and there. And that should auto signal all the way down here. I'm tempted to put one more there and one more there. And we'll see how that gets on. So straight away, we might start seeing passengers arrive at Marlborough st Station. At Marlborough. We're not in Marlborough. We're in Simoncester. Simoncester Station. But it definitely should mean that we can pick up some food for it as well. Because our industry train... So you're missing that stop now, aren't you? But you will pick it up on the next run through. So industry... We've got to make sure it can take food. Industry T1, wasn't it? Let's have a look at you. Uh, boop. That's us there. Perfect. What are we carrying? We're carrying 60 goods. Oh, and do you even stop in this station? You don't stop at the hub. Huh. Oh, you're going to have to, though. You stop at that signal there. Then you come through here. So we're going to have to go... After that signal, add station, hub. Then you can pick food up, right? Yeah, so you're coming into here. I don't like that. Why can't you be on... Wait, 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 wait. Give me that. We're going to go terminals. 
I want industry on terminal 13. That should still work, right? No. Why? Why would that not work? Because that's not a slip switch. Does that help? No. You can definitely go that way. A million percent you can go that way. You're coming along here. Wait, 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 wait. Turn you around a minute. Oh God. Now turn you back around. You can definitely go across here. Why? I don't understand why it doesn't like that. This is a slip switch. Oh, yeah, surely it can go across. Huh. Is anyone going through that slip switch? No. Wait then. So if I just get rid of that slip switch, then we take a track off of here. Onto there. Like so. That should fix that problem, right? No, don't unpause it. Because you're trying to get... Oh, you're trying to get to there. Mm-hmm. Okay, okay, okay. In that case, could we not... This is probably terrible track laying, but I, I, I don't really know. I'm making it up as I go along. That seems really quite slow. We've probably upset a lot of trains now. Who's upset? Green's going to be upset still. But you can definitely go through there. <laughs> a million... Oh, no, you can't, because that's not attached. What have I done there, then? Hmm. Um. Okay, wait, 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 wait. You go away. Oh, I see what I've done. Wait, if I get rid of that... Originally, this track would have went along here into there. So that's sorted. Then we end up with this, this bit here, which is a little odd. So if you could come off of there and go into there, that might sort that, he says. Yes, it does. And then this line needs to come into here at a reasonably good speed, like so. And that should fix it. It does fix it. Okay. My issue now is these trains need to be bigger, right? These need an upgrade. Can I make you longer? Let's have a look at the platform you're going on to. Tell me yes, I can make them bigger. Do you know what? I'm going to upgrade them. I'm going to add more trains to the run. Uh, no, not that one. I want to replace them. Oh, no. No, I... Oh, God. Oh, that's fine. <laughs> we wanted more trains. Do you know what? I might leave it with that many trains and see how it goes rather than replacing them. Is more trains better than long trains? I'm going to say no. But we've ultimately got a lot of trains waiting somewhere. Why are they not coming out? Where are they coming from? Not a clue. They're coming from somewhere. Oh, here. They're coming from here. Here we go. So you're going to come down. The issue is there's too many goods sat here, so it's never going to pick up food. But now it should pick up food. So if we go up to our food factory, all the way up here, you should have another customer, right? Stonehouse, Stroud, Sirencester, and Whitney. So yeah, you've got four customers. And all the food still sat here. So I think we need another train on there as well. Now we've upgraded our food. I definitely think we can get two trains running that. A hundred percent think we can get two trains running that. How are you guys doing? You're doing okay for food. And you've got a little bit of food. Okay, so we need more food demand to up the farms. But so far, not bad. This is concerning. There does not seem to be much coal here. What have I got running this line? Three of them. Manage vehicle. You're empty. You are 
You're full. You're full. Maybe, maybe it's fine. Maybe. That's another one we should definitely keep an eye on. If it needs two trains rather than three, we can knock one of those off. And let's see what's going on here. Anything over spilling? No, we're actually keeping on top of the amount of stuff we've got waiting, which is really nice. You're coming in, you're not picking up anything because there's nothing there to pick up, which is fine. We didn't pick up many goods either. You've got 22 goods. I think once that gets underway, that should be fine. Finally, in Sirencester, is anyone waiting for the train? Yes. Yes, they are. 20, 30 people? You know what? 30 people's good. We may have to consider adding another passenger service to this line if it gets too busy. Which it doesn't look like it is. How many people are waiting there? Three. No, I think it's handling it quite well, actually. Oh, there's a lot of people waiting for Swindon to Ross. So let's go manage vehicle. Would be nice if I could see who's waiting at every station along that route. Oh, yeah, you look like you've got a lot as well. 100 odd. This is a long route, but it, it's popular. 87, 69, and then wait, we got one. Oh no, we got two more. 78 and 21. And then it comes down to Cheltenham, right? 29. Maybe, maybe one more train on there. I presume it's making money. Oh, it is, 1.1. There we go then, that's lovely. So I'm going to let it tick over before the next episode. We'll uh, let the food sort of feed through and see how that gets on. <laughs> We are fulfilling. Oh, I know. We are sort of fulfilling city needs slowly. I've lost where I am now. <laughs> uh, there's the hub. Stroud, how are you doing? Are you getting any food yet? No. Oh, that's because it's all being transported. Give it time. <laughs> Give it give it time i'll let it run through and we'll see how it goes in the next episode if you've enjoyed this episode hit that like button and if you haven't done already please subscribe it does help the channel and until next time i'll see you again